How's it going, everyone? I hope this gun game isn't going to be too chaotic. That might mess up the video, but whatever, man. If you haven't seen on Twitter yet, uh, Plutonium announced that they're going to be working with, with the Rex T5 or T5M, whatever you know them as, to make Plutonium for Black Ops 1. Expect dedicated zombie servers with custom maps. Multiplayer will also be included. Now, I don't know how well you guys remember this, but I think they did like an AMA at some point. And I said that they weren't, they don't do stuff like, you know, like their own version of MW2. Or their own version of Ghost or Advanced Warfare. Because, like, the other people are doing that. Like, the IW4X folk already did that. And they don't really want to compete. Which, honestly, I completely agree with. I feel like that's way better to just, like, you know, let each other do it. It's not like they're making money off of it or anything. And I find that definitely applied here. If they weren't, if they didn't have, have that rule, they would have probably already made, like, their own version of Black Ops 1. But instead, they collaborated with the people who already made their own version. And I might just be wondering, why not just tell the people to play with the other version the truth is i don't know rec t5 i did actually try it like i don't know i think last year and i didn't have the best experience there's just like very widespread just super calm bug they might fix it by this point but where basically the first time you launched the game it was like a 50 50 chance that either you got a bug that it's like that's like a complete nightmare to get rid of you have to do like all these fixes like very precisely or it would actually work just fine. I assume they fixed that by now, but if they haven't, then yeah, that might be one of the factors. But also, I mean, overall, they just didn't promote it as hard. They didn't work on tournaments with YouTubers or anything like that. So it kind of just got left in the dust. They're, they were definitely always just way smaller than the rest of them. So I feel like Plutonium was definitely the right way to go. And, okay, what the f***? This guy's like actually just a gun game sweat dude drop shot knifed the main thing they focused on obviously is the zombies plutonium always had zombies but i feel like they were definitely i feel like zombies overall for plutonium was a lot less mentioned than the multiplayer that's for sure i never i never even tried the zombies on plutonium i'm gonna be honest so maybe the black ops one zombies can drive more people to try it out maybe drive me to try it out and it does mean custom maps so finally black ops 3 on steam will not be the only black ops game with custom zombies maps i mean if you're thinking of it in like an official way then it's still the only one. I should also probably specify that they announced this like three days ago. I don't know why I didn't make a video about it. Jeez. I saw it like when they made the tweet. And it also mentioned the multiplayer, which is kind of the main thing for me. I, I, no, here's the thing. Are, gonna, are, are they going to like coexist with the uh, T5M? Or are they going to like just straight up just merge the two? Just have the T5M guys work on Black Ops on Plutonium. I don't know. I feel like that would maybe make more sense. But also they might still want to do their own thing. I, who knows, man. I swear to God, that shot, shut up, that shot should have hit. Did you guys see what I saw? That should have hit. That should have definitely hit. But yeah, I guess it's kind of just like a quick news update. They didn't give like a release date or anything. They literally said no time score yet. They're still just actively working on it. However, I think it's like, since they're working with like the already existing wrecked T5M base, it's probably gonna be finished like a lot quicker than like mw3 was or world at war but i mean like i love iw4x but they announced controller support like six months ago and we still don't have good controller support i mean take your time i guess but it's, i don't know whatever man thanks for watching